Hey guys, I thought I would make this video to let you guys know about something that you might not have known about Google Street View. We all use it sometimes to figure out where we're going, but some of us are, you know, security conscious for one reason or another, and we don't really want our house maybe to be on Google Street View. So there is actually a way you can have your house blurred on Google Street View. You can request how to do that. And it's actually pretty simple. Basically, you go to Google Street View and you go to your own house, and then you go to the bottom right and click report a problem. Then you have the option to you know, report a certain image and one of the options is if you want your own house blurred. So then you select it, you select the little area of where your house actually is, type in the form of why exactly you want it blurred and describe the house so it's you know, the correct one and then you can submit that form and wait for Google to go and blur it. And then I think it takes maybe a few days for the request to go through. And there's a similar process on Bing. They have street side. It's basically the same thing as street view. And you can request an image to be blurred over there as well. You simply, you know, report the image, select what you want, why, and then fill it out. And you might be thinking, why would you want to do this? Well, I imagine for most people, it's just a matter of simple privacy. You might not want people looking at your house. Or maybe if you're in a bad area or something, you don't want people casing the house before they rob it. I don't really know. Either way, the option is there. So if you guys are interested in it, you can go ahead and do it. Maybe you thought about this or you didn't know if it was even possible. So you guys can let me know down in the comments section below maybe why you would want your house blurred, something like that. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up so I know you enjoyed it. If you want to continue watching, I've got some other videos on the right hand side. You can just click those or look in the description for the same link, like if you're on a phone. And if you want to subscribe, I make new videos three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So I think it should be worth it. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm looking forward to hearing from you in the comment section or on Twitter. I will see you next time. Have a good one.